Welcome to Literosity. I'm Chastity Downing, Middle School Language Arts Specialist for Pinellas County. Before the winter break, we were over at Bel Air Elementary where some second graders were learning about our nation's history. They were using the newest literacy standards in a very interesting and innovative way. All right, boys and girls, welcome to Ellis Island. We're trying to recreate for the kids, like give them an authentic learning experience of what it was like to be an immigrant coming to the United States. So we recreated Ellis Island in the library and had the kids really participate as though they were an immigrant coming to America. What are you writing about? Uh, in, I'm writing about Ellis Island and uh, this is fun and cool. I did I got this some fun because we're gonna experience how the, the when the people came from their countries and see how they they got into America. We tried to make it as authentic as we could um, with the different stations, like a welcome station. And, and do you have a place to stay yet? Excellent. Well, welcome to America. An interview where they had to actually say where they were from, what country, what job um, skill they had. They have to go through a health inspection. All right, your next station is going to be the health inspection. So we're going to check and make sure you're healthy. Did you learn about that? Mm -hmm. um, because they did that on Ellis Island and we ask them some questions uh, you know for them it's fun they have to know you know like a little stethoscope and are you itching anywhere and do you have a fever um, and then there's the citizenship station where they're asked a couple questions about the flag and american symbols and recite the pledge of allegiance and then finally they go and they get their passport and their photo taken at the final station and at each station along the way, they have a little card and they get a little stamp. Um, it says pass, fail, but we always make sure they all make it in. Um, but it's their way to get to, uh, you know, their stamps to allow them into the country. Yeah, it makes me more proud because I have to, I could have more technology in this world, in this America. The second grade team is phenomenal. They really do so much of the teaching um, using social studies standards and some of their literacy standards um, to bring this all together. And they do this, the, a lot of the teaching prior. In the media center, they get some. They, I don't have as much time with them. But all of us worked to uh, collaborate on giving them that background. And they've used you know, multiple resources to do that, videos and uh, books. And at every station, there um, is a video. We videotape the kids. And when they talked, they actually asked each other questions, and there's a little trigger. So every station had kids that were interviewed, and we put it together using um, just an app on the iPad, and it made it come to life for them. So it was very cool, and they got to talk about all the things that they had learned. I think the teachers themselves actually came up with the idea, but the concept probably grew from the standards that, that second grade has for social studies in the idea of why people um, throughout history have come to America and the reasons behind that. With a couple of the kids, um, they're really interacted with the different stations and the questions that they're being asked. Some of the kids are writing uh, uh, journal entries like Dear Diary and sort of really taking on the role of what it was like as an immigrant coming to the America for the first time and sort of leaving their family behind. Some little, one of the little girls was writing about how she felt sad because she felt she was leaving um, you know, her friends and the things that she was familiar with. Uh, one of the little girls outside was like, are we in America yet? Are we here yet? And so they're just, they're really excited and engaged in the process. Um, second grade team, um, we actually started doing the Ellis Island last year and we were trying to find a way to incorporate uh, social studies in with our literacy. And we found that this is a great opportunity for the students to not only learn about their own history and how we've all come from many different places, but to also tie that into our literacy skills. The Ellis Island um, was an island, mm -hmm. and 
And a, a lot of people used to come there. Okay, what is it? Let's go. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Way to go. I like to do the pledge of allegiance for thanking God for giving us, um, giving us America and for giving us food and stuff that we need. I really love America. It's, it's like, I love it. When we come back, Holly Slaughter will take us into a classroom where some of her team is helping primary readers with their English language arts fluency. Literosity returns in a moment. 